Ben. Lev? Another. Another. Lev 16, my man. How's it hanging? Lev 16? That's not my name. My name is... Another, please. My name is... My name is... Another granite helmet. Another warrior's helmet. Another. Would you believe it? Warriors, and let me make myself absolutely clear. Helmet. Back to back? Are you kidding me? Welcome back. Last video, we started the grind for the raw shark and completed a few more sections of the Fremenic Trials. This episode, we're doing the same damn thing, and that's another liar. Woo! And that's 42 attack. Barbarian Assault Time. This is gamble number 20 for some Renar Weed. That's not bad, but also probably not worth keeping. It is a new day. That means new opportunities to get things that I can't use on my ultimate Iron Man. We got today. Ooh, I can wear that. Nice. That's a gear upgrade. Gamble number 23 for Dragon Bones number three. I guess if there's one thing to get duplicates of, it's definitely this. 24. I'm trying to get five Herblore. With that, I'm able to start using Marintil, which currently I don't even pick up. Unicorn Horns are way easier to get than Eyes of Newt, so it'll help me passively train the skill over time. I was hoping I could get one final eye here, but this lamp will leave me 6 XP off the level, which I'm just gonna get by cleaning herbs. Alright, three guams later, we reach level 5. I also picked up two Marantel in that time, so let's clean those and make them into potions. This also frees up an inventory spot that I was saving for noted guams. There's Unicorn Horn number 2. And look at that XP! And best of all, I'll never grind for another Eye of Newt again. Gamble number 25. Uncut Diamonds, I think that's a new one. These are only level 43 crafting to cut, but I can't train that skill until after the trials, so this is a drop. 26, Torstals. We've gotten that one before. Another queen down, but this time I'm wielding the Lyre of Good Luck. That's gonna make all the difference. Magic Seed and an Elite from Gamble number 28. Uh, I don't have a tree patch, and I don't have a Sherlock. Another queen down, Renar Seeds. I do have an herb patch, but it's not going to be for a long, long time. At least my friends support me. Did a bit of AFKing at Crabs. I managed to get 5 strength levels and 2 hit points levels. I'm shooting for 50 strength and defense for the granite helmet and possibly the granite body as well. But for now, back to Barbasolt. Look at this guy. He knows where to get his quality weapons. I feel like the stars have aligned. There are two groups on wave six, uh, both of which had somebody leave, so uh, don't mind me as I slide over to the other team. There it is. That means it's a lucky day, right? 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 Negative, no. That's a negative. That would be no, sir. I really need a break. 21 agility. That made it worse. That, that's, that's not what I needed at all. Might have gotten a little over 50 there, but that's alright. Gamble number 34, Rune Bars. So, uh, so this is how my day's going. Okay. Stop calling Medic, you're at 91. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to look at that, I'm covering it up. And I got coal for Christmas. 36? Oh, not this again. 
Gamble number 37. Uh, drop rate was 1 in 32, by the way, so uh, so that's happening. I'm like the general grievous of helmets over here. So this is the game that broke me. You may have noticed that one of my teammates is dying. You may also have noticed that my vial is not filled. This is because it's wave 2. The inconsistency in teammate skill is what makes this grind frustrating. So this kind soul invited me to a clan of casual barbarian assault players. And by casual, I mean you must have level 5 in your role, and you must know the absolute best meta. And by meta, we're talking attackers with 99 range, we're talking healers that know the exact times to repoison, defenders that do this, and collectors that stand on this tile so that the runners don't run west. I'm kidding, of course. Sometimes they stand on this tile so that the healers don't go too far away. Basically, I learned how to speedrun barbarian assault, but badly. And by badly, I mean... <laughs> The queen was nuts. Another unexpected benefit from this is that I can train agility while waiting for a group. I've never been in a group before that I think, on wave 10, yeah, filling my healing vial is a waste of time. Sub 15, literally the best group I've ever had. And bad loot. Wait a minute. <laughs> Technically doable, but no. I'm headed back to Rock Crabs. I need as much inventory space as possible for healing on these teams, so I'm gonna get the level for this helmet, and I might try the Warrior's Trial as well. And level two magic. Whew, nobody saw that one coming. I got some air runes from a maze random, so I killed some Birthorp citizens for some mind runes. And speaking of randoms, here's the Dr. Jekyll I've been waiting for. Marant- oh yeah. There we go, that's our strength potion for the warrior's trial. And now that we have the stats, let's buy the granite body as well. And that's a bonus 100 in every defensive style, very nice. Although I do look like I'm about to start some conspiracy theories. Six herb lore from the herbs, and I'm thinking cakes are likely my best food right now. There's no weapons or armor allowed for this trial, so I'm gonna die to this troll and leave my stuff on the ground here. Alright, we're all caked up. Bring it, Thorvald. The Warrior's Trial is a fight to the death with Koshe the Deathless. Now, Koshe is... he's... does this guy have a backstory? Ah, the Deathless One. We do not even know if Koshe is his name. Our regular when we found him, he had long lived the daylight of the of the of the to be kept forever safe in a duck egg. Others say he has sworn to be by the gods for the one of the land forever. I can explain. He's Russian. That's the first form already gone. There's the second down. The third form is when things start getting spicy. Ow. Hopefully he doesn't reset while I'm eating. There it is, third form down. And we can lose to the fourth and still pass the trial. I feel very brave. On to the seer. Oh, but after I die to get these coins out of my inventory. Peer the seer's trial is a puzzle. The door is unlocked with a four letter combination. And oh God, there's a lot of stuff in here. This is his house, right? How does somebody live like this? Is that a red herring? Oh, there goes my immersion. And it's actually used in the puzzle. So the fact that it's a red herring is the red herring. All right, give me the key. I'm done with this puzzle. Yes, I'm incredible. Please vote for me. Thank you. Back to Barbarian Assault with such a clean inventory. This is gamble number 40 for some torstal seats. Another queen down. I did a collector run earlier on World 306. I'm getting that up to level 5 so I have another role I can play in the clan. So that's level 3 now. But I also did a healer run, so let's gamble these points for some more dragon bones. Hey, no complaints here. 42, 43, 44. A genie! Because I have no self-restraint, this always goes into whatever I'm doing right now. Uh, so that's 30 agility. I've been training this a lot in between runs, and 30 agility unlocks a new training method. Uh, the blast furnace standing bicycle thing. But look at that XP. This actually isn't that much faster than basalt because it uses run energy, but it is super AFK, so this is where I'll be in between runs. Another queen. I did a defender run earlier as well, so I got level 3 on that. But let's spend these healer points and limp root roots. This normally would be one of the worst things you could get, but for me, they're not bad for secondaries. I could definitely make some strength potions for training soon. 
All right. This is the one. I'm going to use defender points this time. That's how you know you get sharks, right? Defenders defend the sharks of the Runite Ores. Last gamble of the day. Let's see it. Let's see it. Let's see it. <gasps> oh my god, I got it. I got it. Oh my god. And I got an elite. Which... I can do, I can do this elite. I'm so happy. Oh my god, I'm so happy. I never thought I'd see the day. Oh, I gotta get another liar. <laughs> I dropped my liar a while ago. You know, I'm not gonna deal with this right now. And there's our liar. Happy to see one of those for once. We do have one more council member to complete before we finish the Bard's Trial. And that person is... Manny the Reveler's Trial is a drinking contest. No problem, I got this. Well, I lost. Time for plan B. Cheating. Rumor has it there's a guy in Sears Village that sells alcohol-free booze. And in the spirit of cheating, and in order to complete the quest, I have to briefly leave my area, get the stuff, and get back in. Nobody saw a thing, we're good. I'm also gonna unnote a shark while I'm here, just to admire it. I went back to that guy who was spreading rumors and I gave him a beer, and he thanked me by giving me a bomb. This guy seems a little sketchy. Also, I enchanted my liar. Thanks, Fossey. Do re mi fa Wait, that's r <laughs> It's do re mi fa so la ti do. How did they mess that up? As a fun distraction, I put the bomb next to the long haul. I might be taking this cheating thing too far, but at least I won the drinking contest. Now, it's time to perform. Sixteen is my name, I haven't much to say But since I have to sing this song, I'll just go ahead and play We got through the maze, gave Sigmund the flower and had a drink with man Hunted and Thorvald was impressed by my bravery. The sharks were circling as I fought my penance, and finally I stepped up on the stage. Trials completed. This ends the chapter in spite of it all. We turn the page. Recall is the Fremen nickname I've been given, and relic is where I stay. I've set my sights on the legends above, and I'll get there one day. Recall. My name is Recall.